Though for a lot of artists, autumn is the most busy time of the year, which is the case for me too, it is also the most inspiring season, the evening of the year, which satisfies all our senses. I love the colors of autumn, the golden lights, the sands, the colder weather, the coziness, and the sweet melancholy of this season. Even if I have a very busy schedule during this month, I want to leave the magic of this season fully. Autumn has to be experienced in nature. So I put on my hiking shoes, which I don't use enough, I would say. So on Friday, I went with a friend to do a nice half-day walk. My city is surrounded by a quite big regional park where nature and animals are protected. There is no new houses built, only old villages can be, can be seen in this park. Um, these mountains can be reached by foot from the city which is something I really, really like. And it is one of the reasons why I chose to live in this city a few years ago. And we even saw a pheasant during our walk. And I had a wonderful time. It was a beautiful, very warm autumn afternoon. And it was just glorious. It was everything was perfect during this walk. All my boxes of teas and herbal teas were empty. And of course, I also want to have nice autumnal herbal and teas for the season. So I went to my favorite uh, tea shop, which is three minutes away by foot from my home. And I came back with a good collection of different herbal teas. Spicy Dream with a very evocating title. It's a cinnamon spicy rooibos and it's really, really delicious and very pretty. I love these red little things. And my absolute favorite is the honey and apple herbal tea. It has a very, very delicious taste. I really love this one for the season. It's also the season of candles and candlelight evenings, which is probably the thing I miss the most in summer. And I'm just using this season some special biwax candles sent by a sweet English lady last year, last Christmas season. And I didn't dare using them yet because they are very precious. They come from a very, very special place, the Denis Severs House in London, which is a place I really, really like. And I think you can order them, uh, these candles, on their website online. I think, I think it's possible to do that. So they are entirely made in beeswax and they have the perfect fall color. They smell really nice.
I also love working with candles in my studio, which also I can do in the warmer month of the year. And I'm working right now on the new Christmas workshop, so I can't show you anything for now. You will have to wait a bit a little later in November to see all the decors I'm, I'm creating for this new workshop. And you can also, if you want, join the past Christmas workshop. All the other ones, there are quite many and they are all open now. You can join them on my website, learnthemagicofpaper.com and you can start any Christmas workshop if you want to and the new one will come very soon. Once more, I cannot help referring to my favorite author, Jean-Jacques Rousseau, who lived in the 18th century. And he lived fully in the present and he talks about the seasons in his book Les Mille. Je n'imiterai pas ceux qui ne se trouvent bien qu'où ils ne sont point, qui cherchent l'été en hiver et l'hiver en été, mais je resterai en place et je voudrais tirer d'une saison tout ce qu'elle a d'agréable et un climat tout ce qu'il a de particulier. Je voudrais, dans le service de ma table, dans la parure de mon logement, imiter par des ornements très simples la variété des saisons et tirer de chacune tous ces délices. Si j'avais des cerises quand il j'allais des marrons ambrés au cœur de l'été, avec quel plaisir les goûterais-je We should remember this precious and timeless wisdom written in 1762. So this October 31st, all my Halloween workshop closed their doors for good till next year. If you see this video on time, maybe you are tempted to join and you can do it till October 31st at midnight. And then all the Halloween workshops will close till next Halloween season. And all the past Christmas workshops, there are quite many, they are all open and you can join them. You can find all the information about my seasonal workshops and all my workshops on my website, learnthemagicofpaper.com. I have many more videos coming. I try to be more, more consistent and more regular with my videos. So you will have quite many others to see soon. I continue to work on the Christmas workshop and I will show you that very soon. And I also had some questions about my art, when I will update my shop. So I will have new things in my Etsy shop much later in December and January. So for the moment, I, I'm still focusing on the workshops. I will keep you updated anyway on the videos and in my newsletters. I will leave you here. I wish you a beautiful autumn and I hope you are enjoying all the magic of this season. And I will see you very soon.